Today, Sonia and Ankit were planning to play chess in the evening. But when Sonia reached Ankit's house, she saw that he is very upset. What happened, Ankit? Why are you so upset? Sonia, I just read in the newspaper that pollution has become very high in eight cities of our country. According to news, the air in Delhi, Gurugram, Noida has become so bad that it's pathetic to breathe there. People are not even able to get out of their homes. This is so bad, Ankit. How has the amount of pollution increased so much? The main reason behind this is burning of stubbles by farmers in Haryana, Punjab, Uttar Pradesh, and Rajasthan. What is stubble? The crop residue left after harvesting of wheat, mustard, and rice, etc., in the fields is called stubble. Although there are many reasons for pollution, but during winters, due to the integrated burning of the stubbles by farmer, all these cities turn into the gas chambers. I am very disturbed by the pollution of the cities and issue of garbage disposal in our village. At that moment, Ankit's grandfather comes in. His grandfather works in the Department of Environment. Son, being upset will not solve anything. Shouldn't we do something to deal with these problems? Grandpa, we are just small kids. What can we do? Tell me, how do you think these problems can be solved? Grandpa, these troubles can become fodder for cattle if hand harvested or by using cutting edge machines also by the technique of crop residue composting stubbles can be used as fertilizers but either all these processes are very time consuming or cost a lot of money maybe that is why farmers prefer to burn stubbles ankit you would be glad to hear that the government of delhi haryana and other states have started taking right steps in this direction but you must do something towards the problem of your village one minute ankit what is this composting sonia on everyday basis some garbage gets collected in our home out of them some of the waste are biodegradable such as leftover food fruits peels of the fruits and vegetables etc this means that if we dig and put this waste in the soil then in a few days the microorganisms found in the soil will decompose it this technique is called composting okay and this process will greatly benefit farmers too you rightly said son but the problem is that people do not understand their responsibility and here you children can help by making people realize their responsibility well can you tell how can we increase the speed of composting absolutely we can use red earthworms for this biodegradable waste is red earthworms food if we put such waste into the soil by digging pits for compositing earthworms will soon turn it into compost by keeping the soil lightly wet and grumbling it makes it easier for earthworms to breathe and crawl very good ankit we should build many such pits on the collective land of our village after that all of us including our school friends will collect such garbage from every house in the village and make it compost When we children will start doing this everyone will start following it after some time Well done son but this was only half the treatment What does it mean This treatment is only for the decomposable waste What will you do with the waste that does not decompose Yes grandpa this is the biggest problem in front of us we have to go door to door to motivate everyone to dispose wet and dry waste distinctly biodegradable waste also known as wet waste should be separated from dry waste such as plastics aluminum foils that make bright looking packets glass bottles and so on and grandpa when people dispose wet waste into plastic bags it does not easily decompose 
Also, due to the smell of food in plastic bags, some animals assume it as food and eat it. This troubles them a lot. Half of the garbage is decomposed and half is not. This makes it extremely difficult to segregate the waste later on. If the waste is kept separately, at the beginning it will become easier to dispose of the waste. Grandpa, by this we will dispose of the wet waste, but what about the dry waste? Son, the main problem is the separation of garbage. If all the people of the village separate the garbage and collect the dry waste in one place, it will be very easy to recycle them. A lot of government's cooperative programs are working for this recycling process. Now tell me, what you mean by recycle? Grandpa, we will tell this to you tomorrow. Today I have to again defeat Ankit in chess. <laughs>